Hi everybody, Golgoth here. The mining patch has dropped. So I thought, okay, let's uh, set up the selective memory as a mining ship and go and give it a try. I spent an hour at uh, low temperature diamond, triple overlapping hotspot. This is obviously some new usage of the word triple overlapping hotspot I wasn't previously aware of. Um, we knew it was going to be reduced. I managed to find myself 18. I didn't even bother to use all the limpets in the end. I went out with 128 limpets basically. I filled up the cargo. I'm coming back with 49 and I found 18 diamonds. By that time I was just about ready to uh, open a vein. So I thought, okay, let's just go and sell these. 10 jumps away, I'm at Hopkins Terminal in Ross 71. This is the best price I could get. When I looked at it, it was about uh, 900,000 per unit. But of course that could change. The information was a couple of hours old. Um, has it been nerfed too much? Mm, difficult to say, actually. Um, obviously, we're used to mining as it was. Absolutely tedious. But let's be honest, it ain't a lot of dosh. There was so much space generated that you did it anyway. And when you didn't do it, you thought, I should be mining, because I'm going to be earning something. So, at the end of the day, we'll see what this pays. Now, I could have been unlucky. I've, I've got to say that. I, maybe other people can go there and manage to find more diamonds. I might have just been unlucky. But the way things are at the moment, I've got a feeling, because the tritium, there was plenty of tritium. Which is quite interesting actually but that had to happen let's be honest because there was so many stranded carriers so tritium had to be sorted out ASAP before everyone went like jet and paranoid the low temperature diamonds I don't know but let's see what I made in an hour I suppose I better look in Landing authorised. Proceed to landing pad one zero. Back. Oop. Slow down a little bit. Yeah. So this is actually the nearest place. Moderate traffic in this sector. Make way for larger vessels. That's the nearest place with a large pad, to be fair. If I was using a Python, I think I could have got a little bit more money and wouldn't have had to go so far. So, I mean, there's another option. But I had this lying around. I've been using it as an exploration ship. And I thought, let's see how good it is as a miner. Now, before it was nerfed, I think it would have been quite good, actually, because you've got a lot of collectors in it. See, I, I mean, I know people that do mining for a whole day. I mean, that drives me around the bend, but, you know, each to his own. And if you, uh... I, I'm only good for about an hour. That's about all okay. I can stand. So I normally aim for, like, 100 tonnes and then come away. Um... So that's fine. If I can make 100 tons in an hour, I'm happy bunny. I mean, you can make it quicker than that sometimes, but uh, I only dabble. Right, let's see what we got here. Commodities, commodities, commodities. For our 18 low temperature diamonds. I'll sort the ship out in a minute. Uh, commodities market. There we go. Selling. 
Right. Okay, what we're looking at here is... Uh, where are we? 727,000. So I'm going to make 13 million. It's true to say I could have made more running loads. Um, how much it should be is a matter of opinion. Different people will have different ideas. When I first started this game, if you'd gone out and you made half a million, maybe a million in an hour, but this was four years ago. <laughs> Things are a lot different now and the prices are better on a lot of stuff. I mean, combat's still not very good. But I digress. So it seems that the tritium has been increased. The low temperature diamonds, I found one rock with 31%, one with 12%. And there was a couple with like 2% and 5%. Much higher levels of tritium, actually. But as I say, that's a good thing. I mean, at least for the moment. Because, you know, you buy the carrier, you go out, and then you get stranded. That's no good. Uh, there's no fun in that. There's no gameplay. There's no win for anybody in that. So it's... Um, It's basically, I, I don't know whether this is going to be the final adjustment or not. I really don't. Um, I'd like to see everything paying the same, but I don't want to keep banging on about that. As it is, I think I'm going to turn the selective memory back into an exploration ship. And then I'm going to jump in the Python and run some loads. After I've made the coffee. Okay. Fly safe, go go fouls.